Right now, Zeke is in a federal courtroom trying to convince a judge to let him play. He is appealing a six game suspension. Our Joe Trahan is live at the star in Frisco as we await a decision at any moment, Joe. Yeah, that's right. Izzy, down the road in Sherman, we're watching a confusing and complicated legal battle begin to unfold. Cowboys running back Ezekiel Elliott is at that federal courthouse, as you mentioned. He's there for a motion to grant a temporary restraining order to try and stop the NFL from suspending him. Now, the issue with that hearing is that the NFL's arbitrator, Harold Henderson, has yet to decide if he will uphold, reduce, or vacate Zeke Elliott's six-game suspension for a uh, possibly violating the NFL's personal conduct policy. Now, Elliot and his representatives arrived at the courthouse shortly before the 5 o'clock hearing uh, when it was scheduled to begin. The NFL PA has filed suit against the NFL, saying the process by which Elliot was suspended is unfair. Now, if today's hearing goes Zeke's way, he would be able to continue to play for the Cowboys while the suit works its way through the court system. The NFL, meanwhile, trying to get that motion thrown out, saying that since, there, since there's been no ruling on the appeal, it's too early to decide if it's fair or not. And there are other forces at play in terms of what's going on right now uh, with the legal wheeling and dealing. It's the NFL's player union versus the NFL itself. They're also trying to uh, get the best foothold on where this actual venue will be if a court case should take place. The NFL, by holding off on making a decision on the suspension, uh, makes it more difficult for that judge to make a ruling and thereby, because he hasn't ruled yet, they could have a change of venue or they could try and make filings later on in the process and try and have them at another venue. The NFL would love to have this take place at a federal court in New York. Of course, the Cowboys and Zeke Elliott and his representatives with the NFLPA would find uh, a much more uh, favorable judge, they think, right here in Texas. So um, it's interesting. There's a lot going on here. It's really complicated and we'll have more on Zeke Elliott it's hearing coming up for you later in sports.